So it is time to eat green on this Foodie Friday, Chef B, B, and B. <laughs> <laughs> Chef Bianco Bianco has brought bread. Mm. Chef B, B, B. Oui. Oui. This is the first time I've brought bread I, here. I have never seen us eat mm. green with bread. Yeah, yeah. You're going to work some miracles this morning? So, yeah. when, when you think eating green, Chef mm -hmm. Bianco, yes. You don't think last week we did a, a roasted beet, beet. Yes. cucumber salad, yes. all kind of. Yes. That's when when you, when you think mm -hmm. eating healthy, mm -hmm. eating green, mm -hmm. this fellow here mm -hmm. is not definitely. part of the plan as far as I'm concerned. Well, um, yeah, definitely because I mean we all need carbs in our diet, yes. right? So this is good carbs. Um, it depends on what type of bread you actually use. Okay. This is a high fiber bread, right. so it's very good for you. Yeah. Carbs so, so and a fiber. A little carbs. Yeah, definitely. This, this Your body needs carbs. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah don't, don't fall into that myth that you don't need carbs yeah. or carbs make you fat. It depends on the type of carb that you're using. Oh, my. In other words, if I eat about twice this. Well, that would be too much. <laughs> <laughs> Let's eat green. <laughs> Chef Bianca is here once again on a Foodie Friday and we're making, obviously, a sandwich this morning. Totally, yes. So, um, this week, you know, as you know, speaking to me this week, I was not... Chef B was not yeah. up, up to her normal bubbly yeah. self this yeah. morning. This yes, a little under the weather. Yeah, someone yes. threw me a flu, and you know, yeah. you know, I caught it. You know, unfortunately, <laughs> um, that doesn't happen very often right. during the year. But anyway, so I appreciated the time to just relax and chill a little bit. Right. Okay. Um, unfortunately, I wasn't able to eat. Uh, I didn't have the appetite that I normally do, right. so um, I really didn't feel like eating or eat, feel like eating anything heavy or too extensive. So, you know, this was actually one of my go-to meals this week. Why you were not feeling yeah, so well? Yeah, exactly. Oh, okay. So, um, what I did was sandwiches. Right. They're easy. They're quick. Um, you can pack them with um, all, all kinds of really great fats yeah, and fiber yeah. and stuff, and um, just really. Um, Lend your body some nutrition as well, right? right? right so, yeah. um, so I'm going to show you what I did. So um, I have some avocado. Um, this is avocado? Yeah. So what I do when avocado is going out of season, you know, then they get really cheap. So, um, so what I do is I, I crush the meat, I put it in freezer bags, and I freeze them. Oh, yeah, and it stays? So it stays, um, but you can only use it for certain purposes, like we're going to use it as a spread today, so it's going to be good for that. Right, 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 right. I mean, I don't encourage things like trying to make guacamole and stuff, because, you know, that's texture, not going to be texture. pretty. Exactly. Right, yeah, yeah, and, you okay. know, pretty food is very... Important to you. Exactly. Yes. <laughs> so, what we're going to do with this, mm -hmm. we're going to just season this with a little bit of um, salt and pepper, mm -hmm. a little bit of salt. And if you want, you can actually add, I have right here a little bit of chili oil, which is going to be good for what we're doing today, okay? Mm -hmm. You're going to mix that up, nice, nice, and... You know, that chili oil is by a, a local producer, CGE. It smells really it's, good. It's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a brand new oil that we're showcasing on the show this season, um, CGE, doing these oils. So this kind of would have a little nice spicy kind of kick. Yeah, so a nice little kick to it. Right, good. So what I want you to do while I chop the chicken, because this is gonna, actually going to be a chicken sandwich. It's a chicken Yay. sandwich. Chicken and avocado. Mm, okay. 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 And we're going to um, pair that with a little bit of um, fresh salad. Okay, let's okay? go. So you're going to spread that on both sides of the sandwich. I am going to chop the chicken, which I use, um, like a lot of spices, I use um, paprika and um, lots of cayenne pepper because, you know, when you don't feel well, mm -hmm. you, it's, it's, um, you don't want to eat food that's limp in flavor. Okay. So it must, it should be like really full flavor. Pick, pick me up food. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Make me feel like if I'm eating something kind of food, right. you know. Good, good. I got you. I got you. Your so if you are, smell all so the nice chicken? spices. Yeah. So you oh. don't want, I didn't want to put a whole chunk of it because I want for every bite mm -hmm. that you get a nice, a bit of everything in it, okay? Mm -hmm. So um, I'm going to add a little bit of um, red onions, red onions mm -hmm. which you know is one of my favorite That's things, mm -hmm. right? Um, we're going to pack this nice and tight with some meat. I mean, I know Joel 
um, well enough to know that he will actually want to add some bacon to this, which he actually can. But I'm not seeing any bacon. <laughs> there is no well, bacon I here. I said Joel. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't say me. <laughs> I am just showing you what I what I ate this week. Okay, Fair. Joel. Fair. All right. So the chicken great. is full of flavor. The, the, chicken, the chicken is, is full, full of flavor. Of flavor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So I am gonna cut the um, lime. I'm gonna drizzle a little bit of lime on here. Remember, wow. you want something to be pow Sweet. with flavor. Okay, when you when you don't feel well, when you don't when you can't taste anything. And that's just that's what freshens up the just the chicken fresh. It gives it a nice bright. You see, you actually used the yeah. word there I, I, I did, that I you did. weren't aware of. I was that's aware. <laughs> I was aware. So what we call it, it, it gives it a nice bright flavor. Fresh flavor. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. So Chef, now you're taking me for granted now. Right. Do, yeah. Oh gosh, I am so sorry. I didn't mean to do that. So you are um, when you're making a sandwich, you really want to press it out. Okay. Um, then we're gonna get a nice. Over here. Okay. Oh, you're going to Well, yeah, let me yes, use the Mr. right Rated tool. Mike. Oh, gosh. Chef let me, me use the right Chef tool me. for the right job. Chef, yeah, I have your back here in the kitchen. I, I, well, I, mean, I so appreciate <laughs> that. That's really fabulous. So, you see, like when you pick wow. it up, you want it to look nice and ooey like that. So, you can freeze. Okay. Avoc avocado totally. and, and get it back to use as a nice little spread. That's so as a I spread, never knew that. yeah, yeah, yeah. So now, that. I mean, we don't want to eat that alone. So we're gonna pair it with a nice, like, tomato, light salad. Okay. So I'm gonna go back and add some more of that, those onions. So this is sandwich and salad. Yeah, nice, easy sandwich and salad. You know, you're not running around looking for too many ingredients. I mean, if you want. Um, you can actually add more of a kick. I had some some fresh cayenne pepper that I chopped. You know, if you if you like. This is hot hot. Kick. That's hot hot. This is yes. hot hot. Yeah. So um, and I'm actually one little tip is that when you when you when I have a, a cucumber salad, one thing that brings out the flavor and the fullness of cucumbers is adding actually a little bit of um, sugar to it, a little sweet. Okay. To cucumbers. So yeah, to cucumbers. Um, it just um, makes the flavor nice and rounded and full. Right. Okay. So we're gonna toss this nice. Cucumber is like the star of the show today because I did a cucumber and watermelon drink to the top of the show today. And how come I didn't get any? You came late. <laughs> 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 you came a little late. And it was tasting really good, so we drank all of it. You see, well, I don't yes. believe you. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody always says that when I didn't get any. Yes. <laughs> wow, that looks good. Right? So, I mean, even when you're sick, you also want to think about eating with your eyes, you know? Um, it will actually make you feel like eating. Yeah, because if I brought that sandwich for you just plain like that, you would send me back to well, the kitchen. Well, I'll eat it, but then I'll say, couldn't he have fixed that up a little bit? <laughs> So, so My there, goodness. there you go. Folks, eating green with some carbs. Isn't that fantastic? Chef Bianco Bianco, it's a chicken and it's not guacamole because it's, you no, wouldn't call it guacamole. A it's a spread. It's, a, it's, an, it's avocado an avocado spread, spread chicken yes. avocado spread yes. sandwich with a nice cucumber salad. Yeah. Cucumber and tomato salad. Yeah. We eat green on a cup of joe to close things off on a foodie Friday. Simple as it is, check this recipe out on trainingcooks.com. Chef Bianco Bianco drops by just to show us how we can eat green, healthy, and if you need to pick me up, a nice chicken sandwich with a nice side salad will do. Hope you feel better next week. Yeah. You're taking a little run away from me? I I'm am. not going to see you over the next couple no. weeks. No, <laughs> yes. Chef BB joining us, as I said. Thank you very much, Chef Bianco Bianco.